All right, Shalom. First and foremost, we would like to give all praise, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rechach, Kodash, Dawan Zatai, El, Apostle, Great Mules, and Adur Will, and Salutations and Blessings to Akin, that's pushing his word with true sincerity and charity. All right, today we're just going to get into this quick lesson. going to title it, This Wisdom this wisdom Gives you every gives us everything we need. All right, man? All right, you can look at the example of uh, King Solomon, man. All right, King Solomon asked for only wisdom. All right, that's the only thing he asked for, man. All right, and Yahweh Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai gave him everything, man. All right? Gave him everything that he uh that he can imagine, man. You know, on this side, you no know, man he gave him a, a kingdom, you know, a, a peaceful kingdom, man. All right, gave him a rulership over his enemies, man. You know, hey, the list goes on and on, man. But hey, that's what this wisdom gives you, man. You know, so hey, any further ado, we go jump to it. This Proverbs chapter one and verse one it says, the Proverbs of Solomon, the son the son of David, king of Israel. All right, it says to know wisdom. And instruction to perceive uh, the words of understanding, to receive the instruction of wisdom, justice, and judgment and equity, to give uh, subtlety to the simple, to the young man, uh, knowledge and discretion. All right. Amen. That's what wisdom gives us, man. All right. To know wisdom gives you all those things, man. <clears throat> it gives you a way to move out here, man. All right. It showed you how, how to actually, uh, actually uh, conduct yourself, man. All right. How to move out here uh, among the indiscreet, man. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Amongst these fools out here in this world, man. All right, not uh, um, lower yourself to a level. All right, well, sometimes you do have to lower yourself to a level, man. Uh -huh. You know, it gave, but it's all through wisdom. Yeah, it gave the boss up. You know, you it says subtlety, uh, subtle to the simple. Mm -hmm. You know, so basically it's, it completely changes you, man. You know, once you get uh, using the word use, uh, uh, susceptible to anything, when you get that wisdom, you put on a whole armor of the most high, man. And then hey, you get you get that you know upgrade on this side, man. Yep. Above all these other dumbasses, man. Right, right. Cause they 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 looking at this world as being wisdom, man. All right, mm -hmm. but according to Sirach, nineteen and twenty two, that is not wisdom, man. Cause this world is filled with nothing but wickedness, according to the uh, Job nine and twenty four, man. Mm -hmm. All right, that's who rules this world is the wicked, man. All right, Sirach the Tim chapter, man. All right, hey, hey, the demands of these people are the same way as their ruler, man. Come All right. On. And uh, wisdom, Solomon the sixth chapter, this talks about how we are sovereigns, man. So hey, we 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 don't we not under these uh under these laws these people are. Of course, we uh, agree with our adversary quickly, but no, we're not gonna agree with me. Say eat pork, you know, do this, do that, uh, commit adultery. No, we you know, we hey, we on the time we have about Shemel Shai, man, and we hey, that's what we seeking to please, man. Right. So, hey, verse 6 says, to understand a proverb and the interpretation, the words of the wise and their dark sayings. The fear of Yahweh is the beginning of knowledge, mm. but fools despise wisdom and instruction. All right, man? Mm. So, hey, we fear Yahweh by Shemel Shai, man. All right? Therefore, hey, we're going to have that wisdom. All right? We're going to have that knowledge, man, and understanding, man. All right? But only a fool would despise this, man. All right? Because, hey, hey you're not going to know how to be a man, man. All right? That's what this wisdom gives us, man. All right, hey. Hey, man, you're not going to know how to be a man. You're not going to have a uh, uh, rulership, man. And ultimately, you're going to die, man. All right? So this is um, Wisdom of Solomon 87. It says, And if a man love righteousness, her, law, her labors are virtues. For she teaches temperance and prudence, justice and fortitude. All right? And all those are manly attributes, man. All right? That's what this wisdom gives you. If, you don't have, if, if you're not in this truth, man, all right, hey, ultimately, you're a sodomite, man. All right, you're a, you're a fucking woman, man. All right, because you're, you're, you're effeminate. All right, and that's exactly what this world pushes, man. All right, if you're a part of this world, man, all right, you, you're, you're going to uh, do the things of the world, man. All right, you're in the flesh, you're going to mind the things of the flesh, man. All right, and these guys, man, they, they, don't, they, they don't have that, uh, that will, uh, that heart, man. All right, because they don't have wisdom, man. All right, and that's why the Lord, that's why it says in the scriptures, why, why doth a man uh, have his hands uh, um, on his loins like a traveling woman, man, you know? Because when all hell breaks through, these niggas ain't going to have shit, man. All right? Because all their wisdom is going to fail them. So it says, which, which are such things as men can have nothing more profitable in their life. All right? So a man can have nothing more profitable in his life than his wisdom, man. Mm. You know? So, hey, why, why, would you, why would you not choose this, man? You know? <laughs> you have to be a fool, man. Because mm. fools hate knowledge, man. Yep, yep. So uh, what you ask on? Oh, come on. Yep. This is Sirach 4. Mm -hmm. And I start at verse 11. It says, Wisdom exalted her children and lay of hold of them that seek her. So, hey, it exalted her children, man. Hey, above all these other people, man. Hey, be knowing 
the fear of Yahweh Bashem Al Shai. That that is wisdom, man. Right. If you don't know the fear of Yahweh Bashem Al Shai, keep his commandments, love him, man. You threw out here, then you know death. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Pursuing the Proverbs eighth chapter. Yeah, that's right. You know, but continuing on, it says, "He that loveth her, loveth life, and they that seek to her early shall be filled with joy." Only good things, man. As the brother read in Proverbs one, is no, it's nothing more profitable in this life, man. It's nothing more profitable in general, man. But it says, verse thirteen, "He that holdeth her fast shall inherit glory, and who and wheresoever she." It's so like, and wheresoever she enters, the Lord will bless. All right. And that's heavy right there. Wheresoever she enters, she enters in you, man. It says, wisdom will not enter into malicious soul. That's right. So, hey, if she, if she enters you, man, that is, you're going to be blessed by the Lord. The Lord is obviously dealing with you if he gives you that increase. Because only the Lord can give you that increase. But verse 14 says, they that serve her shall minister to the Holy One. And them that love her, the Lord doeth love. So them that love wisdom, the Lord loves. It's hey, it talks about that in um what's that? Um what's Rock Six? Uh what would you say? It talks about um how that the love love the Lord love is none, but them that dwell of oh, wisdom. That's, uh, yeah, I think that is Rock Six. I'm saying uh you said Wisdom Solomon Six? Yeah, it's probably Wisdom Solomon. Yeah, I think it's Wisdom Solomon. Well, right, we can go there right quick. Come on. That's a good precept. I think it's like, uh, Sorak seven. Ah, oh, okay, seven. Um, I mean, uh, wisdom Solomon seven. Ah, oh, wisdom Solomon seven. Okay, twenty-eight. Ah, right, this wisdom Solomon seven to twenty-eight says, "For Yahweh loveth none but him that dwelleth with wisdom." So hey, the Lord only loves him that dwelleth with wisdom. If you don't have that wisdom, you're not you're not uh, worth anything. You right. don't fear the Lord. You susceptible to doing anything. As the brother uh, said, you're you're a sodomite, man. Mm -hmm. You're effeminate. You 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 are susceptible to breaking the commandments. Yeah, hey, hey, you break one man, you, you broke them all. all. You know? So hey, it ain't, ain't far fetched for a man that's smoking a blunt, man. All right, one day he he get so fucking happy, man. He just had sex with his with his fucking friend or some shit, man. You know, <laughs> Sodom ass his friend, man. You know, and, hey, that's truly that's that's what's on these niggas, man, man. We gotta point this shit out, bro, because that's what these niggas really think, man. They really do that shit, man. Yeah. They don't <laughs> and you have a conversation them. with some of these niggas, man. I right, you be like, man, this this guy's a fucking sodomite, man. The, yeah, the stuff he, the, yeah, <laughs> you don't even want to. Guys making gay though. jokes and shit, man. The thing that's funny. Come on, man. And that's because they don't have wisdom. Right. They don't understand that hey, if you if you are doing that, if that's your mindset, the Lord is going to ultimately give you a, a harsh judgment, which you deserve. That's going to be your reward, man. Yeah. You over here, if that's all you bring to the table, man, the Lord is going to destroy you. Right. Right. Because hey. you don't have wisdom. That's right. Hey, I'm going to grab this right quick. Sirach 6 and 22. It says... For wisdom is according, it says, yeah, for wisdom is according to her name, and she is not manifest unto many. Yeah. So wisdom is not given unto many, man. Yeah. All right? That's why you have a majority of these people, man. All right? Hey, especially two-thirds of our, of our nation, man. All right? And all kind of folly, man. All kind of wickedness, man. All right? Because they trust in this world, man. I they trust in the ideologies of this life, man. They don't trust in the wisdom of Yahweh Hashem Al Shai, man, which is true wisdom. Right. Anything outside it is not wisdom, man. Right. The only wisdom is this is these words, man, is these scriptures, man. That's it, man. Right. Uh, to touch on the point, uh, the Lord, what did He say to Ezra? He said, "I, I have showed this to you and and feel like you, man." Right. So he, his Lord said in Job the twenty second chapter, He's going to save the island of the innocent. The, the Lord isn't going to save everybody. The Lord isn't going to give wisdom into everybody. The Lord, hey, everybody ain't going to be riding with the Lord, man. These people want to ride with Esau. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Second Ezra, the ninth shot, the Lord said he's going to uh, save a grape out of a cluster, man. Right. <laughs> hey, if you if you haven't seen a cluster of grapes, man, it's, that's it's, that's scary, man. It's a, ha it's a lot. Yeah. And, it, and it, he said, let the multitude perish then. Yep. Multitude. Multitude that was, it said that was born in vain. Right. And all because they don't have wisdom. Right. <laughs> it said as a wave is to a drop. 
Yeah. That's how many people are going to be destroyed compared to the people that are going to be saved. That drop is the uh, people that's going to be saved. In a big way, it's the people that's going to be destroyed, man. Man. All the heathen nation plus two thirds of Israel. That's a lot, man. Hey, 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 it says uh, blood up to the horse's bridle. Yeah. Shit. That's a, that symbolizes a lot of, man, a lot of death and destruction over here. Come. The Lord said, um, by uh his sword, by his fire and sword, you know, where he plead with all flesh, mm -hmm. Isaiah 66. Yep. But it's more than Sirach 4, just a little bit more. Come. Um, ver Sirach 4 and verse 15. It says, Whosoever giveth ear unto her shall judge the nations. All right. And he that atten he that attendeth unto her shall dwell securely. And you you have that defense. The Lord is going to be on your side. The Lord is going to be dealing with you. You're gonna have you're gonna be able to um um, and, uh, um judge the nations. You're gonna be able to judge the uh, the whole earth. The rulers of the universe. You're going to be uh, joint heirs with our Lord and Savior, our big brother, my, uh, uh, Yahweh Shai Mashiach, man. Right. <laughs> hey, that's... Wisdom can get, wisdom gives you that, man. Yeah. All you got to do is forsake your, forsake yourself, man. Right. All right? Hey, hey, put put aside the shit that you want to do, man. All right? And choose Yahweh Shai man. All right? And hey, you're you you, you you're going to be able to do whatever you want to on the next side, man, in righteousness, man. You know? Which is a, a the, be the best way of life, man. Damn. You know, hey, peep this. Verse, continue on, verse sixteen. Hey, you going right into it? it? Says, if a man commit himself unto her, he shall inherit her, and his generation shall hold her in possession. Right, right. If a man commit to her, yeah, yeah, commit himself unto her, man. As you was talking about, Con. So hey, you, hey, what does scripture say? If you be willing, you know you're gonna inherit the uh, land. Hey, you these people, they don't have the will to do this. They don't want to come out on the highways and byways in the cold. Yeah, they they got to go party on on Saturdays, man. Right. They got. Uh, they don't want to be seen. They don't want to uh, confess their savior openly. Right. They want to be secret on uh, secret uh, uh, Israelites, man. And the Lord ain't dealing with that. You ain't got no works. How you got faith? Yeah. How you believe? You ain't you ain't doing nothing. Right. Yeah. Hey, you ain't out there in the field, man. Right. <laughs> you literally got to be out there in the field, man. All right, hey, and if and if your calling is it to be a prophet, man, all right, you got to do the things that that's that's gonna serve you. How about Shemal man? Mm -hmm. All right, work at your own salvation with fear and trembling, man. Right, you know. So hey, I'm gonna get this right quick as you was uh touching on the rulerships, man. So this is uh Wisdom of Solomon eight and verse thirteen. It says, "Moreover, by the means of her, I shall obtain immortality." And leave behind me an everlasting memorial to them that come after me. All right? So, hey, man, when you choose this wisdom, man, it gives you immortality, man. All right? Why? Because you're going to be changing the twinkling of an eye, man, when our Lord comes back and see and seeing that you have uh, held this word unto the end, man. All right? Because, hey, he that endure to the end shall be saved, man. So it says, verse 14, I shall set up the people in order and the nation shall be subjected unto me. All right, man. So, hey, that's what this wisdom gives you, man. It gives you a, a rulership, man. It gives you a, um, 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 authority over all these nations, man. All right, a hey, judging the twelve tribes of Israel, man. You know, like the Lord told uh, um, Simon Peter. Yep. So it says in verse fifteen, horrible tyrants shall be afraid when they do but hear of me. I shall be found good among the multitude and valiant in war. After uh, after I come into mine house, I repose myself with her. For her conversation have no bitterness, and to live with her have no sorrow, but mirth and joy. All right, man. Because right. because this wisdom gives you life, man. All right, it quickens you, man. All right, it gives you it gives you an understanding of everything that you need to know, man. You know. So, hey, man, hey, hey, choose wisdom, man. Hey, that's that's this is the greatest thing that you ever have, man. Right. All right, hey, far above riches, man. All right, because hey, these niggas they 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 choose um this world, man. All right, because they think they can get riches, man. They sell out. All right, think that's gonna save them, man. But hey. Nothing is above this wisdom, man. This is Proverbs 16 and 16. How much better, how much better is it to get wisdom than gold? And to get understanding rather to be chosen than silver. All right, man? Because hey, you would ask a nigga, hey, what uh if you had a wish right now, what would you ask for? He'd say, shit, I want $300 billion. Right. You know? Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. Ask around a nigga, he go. I want this, I want that. Or I want to be a rapper or some stupid shit, man. Some carnal to gain money. Yeah, to gain money. And fame. When you can shoot, when you can say, you know what? I wish I, I had wisdom, you know? 
Hey, then you choose wisdom. Now you got immortality. Money can't give you that. <laughs> Money cannot give you that. Look at dude. Uh, uh, who's that? Where are you? A, a rock? A rock? Yeah, the rock. Child? Yeah, yeah, yeah. A the rock, rock child. Yeah, who who want to have six heart transplants? Yep. Hey, you have you got all the money. You got the hey the, uh, the uh, this rulership of the earth right now, man. Yeah, and you still couldn't. Be and you, and you, live you, yeah, you still can't live forever, and you can't keep your youth, man. Right, you know, be old as hell. Can't wrinkle, even, wrinkle, ride can't get up. You right, can't, you can't even have uh, fun. <laughs> you just want to die. Yeah, might as well. Come. You're still in the flesh, and you can you can get sick. Say say you ruling. You you ruling for like five years, you get sick. Hey, Alexander the Great. Yeah, yap, yap, yap. Alexander yep. the Freak. Yeah. Yeah, he was in the rule for uh, long. And he didn't even have children to inherit. He was too much of a Sodomite. Con. Because he didn't have wisdom. Right, right. And he was a fucking Edomite, man. Yeah. You know? <laughs> they can't have wisdom. Yeah. They only have wickedness. It says when, they, uh, when he came in um, power... Uh, yeah, uh, wickedness increased. Yep. No. Yep. Uh, evil's multiplying evil's the earth. Multiplied in the earth. <laughs> multiplied. Con. Damn, man. Oh, you got some? No, nah, I was looking for some right quick. Con. I made this Proverbs two right quick. Con. This uh Proverbs two, and uh, you know what? I started verse one. It says, "My son, if thou wilt receive my words and hide my commandments with thee." Uh, so so that thou incline thine ear unto wisdom and apply thy heart and apply thine heart to understanding. All right. Uh, you know, I'm gonna read it over. It says, My son, if thou wilt receive my words and hide my commandments with thee. All right, so hey, you gotta have the you gotta you gotta have these commandments inside inside of you, man. All right, you gotta keep these commandments in your man, man, 24-7, man. All right, hey, this 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 wisdom is is, is our everything, man. All right. So it says, So that so that thou incline thine ear. Unto wisdom and apply thine heart to understanding. Yea, if thou criest after knowledge and lift and liftest up thy voice for understanding, if thou seekest uh, her as silver and search it for her uh, as for hid treasures. All right, so hey man, you gotta search for this wisdom, man. All right, hey, hey if you if you if you if you are one that 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 loves understanding, man, that loves knowledge, man. All right, and hey, you have to seek for this, man. All right, you gotta truly be yearning. For 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 uh, uh, more understanding, man. All right, how about Shmuel Shai? We're revealing unto you, man. You know, hey, hey, hey. That's a quick testimony for me, man. Hey, uh, you now I was going through something, man. You know, before the truth. You know, I was I was seeking after understand. I was seeking after uh, uh, some to know, man. You know, and then next thing you know, man, I ran across a uh, a uh, uh, camp, man. You know, I ran across uh, brothers. You know, was passing out flyers of uh, um, you know, uh, uh, of us being Israelites, man. You know. Hey, that's how I woke up, man. But you got to seek after this wisdom, man. You got to truly want understanding, man. So it says, Then shalt thou understand the fear of Yahweh and find the knowledge and find the knowledge of Yahweh. All right, man. So hey, you will find the Lord, man. All right. But hey, that's ultimately if the Lord is is is, is seeking for you, man. All right. If you're a part of the elect, man, you know, that's true. Hey, that's truly what it is. But hey, the elect is gonna search for the Lord, man. You know, and that's what you got to do, man. You got to search for this wisdom. You got to want this wisdom, man. You know, so so it says uh, for Yahweh, give it wisdom out of his mouth, uh, come in knowledge and understanding. He laid up sound wisdom for the righteous. He is a buckler to them that walk uprightly. So, hey, man, mm. it's only for the righteous, man. Right. All right. Those that those that that that, that had this in their past life, man. Because why? Hey, this is Sirach 27. In verse nine, God. it says, "The birds will resort unto their light. So, uh, so will truth return unto them that practice in her." Mm -hmm. So, hey, the truth is gonna return unto those that once practice in her, man. All right, if you had the truth inside your past life, man, your how about Shmuel Shai is gonna return it right back onto you, man. You know, cause hey, the elect is gonna be the elect, man. All right, no matter what, man, you always gonna serve your how about Shmuel Shai, man. Right. At the end of the day. Con. So, um. Yeah, y'all, this is uh, verse 8, uh, Proverbs 2 and 8. It says, He keepeth the paths of judgment and preserveth the way of his saints. Then shalt thou understand righteousness and judgment and equity, yea, every good path. All right, man? So, hey, Yahabah Shemal Shah protects those that trust in him, man. All right, protects those that have this, that have, uh, that have this wisdom, man. All right, because he doesn't love anyone unless they have wisdom. Right. You know? You got to choose this wisdom, man. You got to choose Yahabah Shah, man. Yeah, you know? man, it's you know, uh, 
like the anime code Geass. Mm-hmm. When um, uh, Lelouch, he yeah. told uh, 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 Susagaki to not die. You yeah. know, he had the Geass power, and then it, it was impossible for him to die, man. The Lord has programmed the righteous to be righteous. It's, it's impossible for them to, to uh, want to go off. Yeah. It's literally impossible to, for them to uh, uh, willingly sin. Right. It's, right. It's not, it's not programmed to them to do that. Yeah. Just like it's not programmed for Esau Eden to do good. Right. Hey, hey, can you make a crooked thing, a crooked thing straight? Right, right. <laughs> hey, can uh, um, he that he do good that is accustomed to do evil? Right. You know, so he hey, he's going to be accustomed to do evil. And the righteous are going to be accustomed to do righteousness. Because that Hebrew word for uh, a custom is the Hebrew word Lamad. And it goes into being trained in, practicing, uh, basically what you learn. Right. And that's what the, hey, the righteous are trained in to know, man. Yeah. Righteousness. It's right. That's it, man. That's it. I got this in Matthew 6. Calm. No, you got it, bro. Calm. <clears throat> you, you want to end on that? Yeah, we can do on that. All right, come. This Matthew chapter six and verse thirty three it says, "But seek ye the king, like it, but seek ye first the kingdom of Yahweh, and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added unto you." That's right. So right, hey, we, hey, all these things are going to be added unto you. Is what happened with Solomon? You know, hey, hey these this is a hey, basically things that are written for time were written for our learning. So reading these are righteous examples for us to find, man. The mistakes and the uh, 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 the wisdom that comes with it, man. You know, uh, the brother Jeremiah always says this. He says, you know, uh, 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 basically a smart man, he he learns from his mistakes. But a wise man looks at the mistakes of a smart man and basically avoids them. Right. You know, so you got to have that wisdom. Yup, yup. Hey, hey, that's the rock the sixth chapter, man. All right, hey, hey, letting out the parables escape you, man. Yeah. All right, hey, hey, understanding that these men, you know, they they went through a hey, dealing with X Y Z women. Yeah. You know, and hey, they give you the breakdown, so hey, you don't have to go and deal with that shit, man. Mm-hmm. You know, hey, avoid, hey, avoid the nigga woman. You know. <laughs> right. Hey, man, hey, take, take, take that that wise advice, man. It's yeah, that's why. Hey, it's a don't despise your youth. Yeah. It's a blessing to be a young brother. You get all these examples. You can avoid jams, mm-hmm. man. Just by the older brother telling you use wisdom. Right. Hey, had that good credit. Right. You know, even though hey, that, that's carnal, but hey, it's still a good thing it's to still, have good credit. <laughs> right. It's, it's still wise, man. Yeah. You got to uh, operate on this society. I mean, in this society as well. Con. But hey, on your spiritual side, man. Man. Yeah, hey, when you so good, you when you so, you know, uh, cut, um, entwined with the spirit on, uh, when you're on point, you can avoid a lot of situations on the carnal side. Right. Just like King David, walk with wisdom, man. Yep. You know? Yep. That's right. And it says wisdom, and it says um, seek ye the kingdom, you know, and all your harvest righteousness. It said um, wisdom bring it forth, wisdom bring it to a kingdom. kingdom. Yep, that's right. Yeah, that's and right. wisdom of Solomon 6, child. Yep, yep. Hey, yep. It, it all ties back, man. Kind. That's why it's precept upon precept. Yeah. That's yeah. the only way to get the understanding, man, to truly, to truly see the picture. Right. You know, so hey man, hey at the end of the day, man, shoes wisdom, hey your shoes in life, man. Right. So hey, with this, with that, we pray that this lesson was edifying. We like to give all praise, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rachakudash. The ones that tie the apostle of great millstone to do it well, and citations and blessings to Akin that's pushing his word with true sincerity and charity. Shalom and a Baba Ball. A Baba Ball.